take some questions. Would you like for me to start with that right there? Yes. <laughs> Katie would like for me to recognize that she had four offensive rebounds mm -hmm. the day after she got cussed out when the game before the game started to get to the offensive boards. Okay, can we start now? Yes. All right, great. <laughs> uh, no, no, that, definitely a great effort to, to my young ladies, you know, and, and, and they knew it would be tough. And the same thing happened to us last year here. You know, we came out, we jumped on them right away. They kind of made their run right back at us, but you know, they just, we got our composure and we got back in the game and won it like we were supposed to. Questions? Chance, was this one of your better games to play in college? Uh, yeah, it was. Um, we all had a lot of energy when we first came out, and um, our defense is what we do, so we had a lot of energy when we came out with that, and it just stayed with us. Yeah. Well, certainly it got some talk about before the game. How, how big is it to keep that, you know, now it's a five-game winning streak against Alabama here on your home court going? Um, well, um, it's always fun to beat Alabama. I mean, any win at home is a good win. But, um, you know, the whole rivalry and all, that's uh, fun to do. But at the end of the day, it's just another win. And, you know, we got to take it and learn from it and enjoy it. But move on. We play the game quick. Andy, what did you guys do better in the second quarter when you built your lead? Um, well, we just had energy. I mean, we kind of came out a little bit flat, um, and we started talking on defense um, and on offense, too. Um, I thought we were a little stagnant on offense in the first quarter, but um, we picked it up, and we started getting the ball into Tracy, and she was able to find us and kind of open it up for the rest of us. Coach, um, how much easier does it make it to win when you guys have plus 13 rebounding advantage? Um, it's huge. I mean, and rebounding hasn't been what we've, you know, done extremely well. Um, so it was a point of emphasis that we've made the last couple of days. Of that is, um, you know, because we have to. I mean, a lot of teams are really killing us on the offensive boards. We have to get in there and we have to rebound. But more importantly, we had to get to the offensive boards ourselves. Um, and one thing that I thought we did extremely well tonight was we shot free throws. I mean, we were 14 to 16, especially uh, down the stretch there when we really needed those free throws when they were making their run. Overall, how, how pleased were you just defensively, how you guys played? Oh, good, good. You know, I, you know, I mean, we forced them into 19 turnovers. Probably could have been a little bit more turnovers. Um, they started, you know, being a little bit more aggressive. We got to learn how to close those traps up a little bit more. But it's tough. I mean, if they come in full speed at Tracy, she's either going to do one thing, foul, that's it. Um, so she's got to, you know, learn how to be a little bit more under control there. You mentioned the rebounding, um, seven more offensive rebounds than them, 17 second chance points. How much of an emphasis was that uh, leading up to this game, especially for me? You talked about, you know, Katie kind of got cussed out for not getting the offensive yeah. board support. Yeah. And, and, and we knew we knew that they didn't box out extremely well, you know, but, but we hadn't been crashing the boards. I mean, we showed Katie on film because she had been standing around a little bit, kind of just watching. Jazz had been watching. Anytime we can get Brandy going to the offensive boards, it's always great. Tracy's in there already, so she's going to rebound. We really needed the wings to come in there and rebound a little bit more and crash the boards. How big was it to have the balance scoring every year? Four players in double figures tonight. It's huge. I mean, it's huge. And, you know, we always talk about, you know, KT, Brandy, and Tracy, you know, being our big three and our scores. Anytime you can have, you know, Jazz. Um, Janiyah, anytime you can have somebody else step in and give us the score that we need, it is great. You know, we always when they score, we we usually win. I mean, it, it becomes an easier game for us to win. Um, but Jazz tonight really gave us that extra bonus. That we need. And Jazz can do that every night. You know, she sometimes comes out a little tentative. When she had her first corner jump shot and then hit her second one, I knew at that point she got the confidence that she needed. Uh, for Katie or Jazz, what was the thought there that when they cut it to six kind of late in the game? Do you guys like by 20 at one point? Yeah, I mean, that just can't happen. Um, and we knew that, and um, once again, we had kind of gone flat, and so um, we had to. Tell them what you had. Can I just Oh, Oh, yeah, we just got really timid when they were, went into that 2 3 trap, and um, I asked her, could we just attack? And she was like, yeah, go. And I think. Once we started doing that, we were able to open that lead back up. But um, I mean, we're an experienced team. We, I think, had you know five returners in the game at that point, and we've been in those situations. So we were able to handle it and get that lead back up.
Anything else? All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.